so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great so today's video we are going to talk about how you can apply the different different map into your models so without any further delay now let's get started tutorial and we'll also talk about how you can set up that kind of beautiful node setups here you can see we have a different different node setup here we have a mapping node we have a texture node we have a displacement also so how you can create that kind of uh, node setup also and uh, for creating that kind of node setup basically you need all kind of map like here you can see we have all maps it's called basically diffuse map it is a roughness map this is also displacement this is normal map so we need all kind of map and if you have that kind of maps so you can create that kind of beautiful and perfect node setup basically okay you, and one more thing i just want to tell you before starting the video if you guys wanted to do practice on this uh, project file so you guys can download this project file from the description that will be free for my all subscribers so now let's start the tutorial so first of all i'm just going to start a new blender file so i'm just going to start a new blender file something like that and i'm just going to rid of this cube pressing the delete then i'm just going to import my model yeah so like here you can see we have a model here yeah so here you can see we have a model here i'm just gonna double click and now here you can see we have a model okay now i'm just gonna split my screen something like that on the left hand side i will just uh, use as a render view so we can see what's going on here and i'm just gonna disable this overlay so we can see only model nothing else and on the right hand side i'm just gonna change this editor as a shader editor something like that and i'm just gonna press the n okay so right now here you can see we don't have any kind of maps here okay i'm just gonna rid of this normals first of all because we don't want normal yeah so right now here you can see guys we have only principal psdf map and so now you have to just import the all the maps which is you have here by the way and you will also get these map into the uh, project file so make sure you download this project file okay and after that what you have to do you have to just uh, enable one add-on it's called basically a node wrangler okay you have to just search the node wrangler so here you can see that that's called node wrangler you have to just enable from here and after enable make sure you just say preference okay now what you have to do you have so after that you have to just click your principal bsdm node then you have to just press the control shift t and when you click the control shift t you will get a new dialog box you have to just go to there where you have save your all textures so now i'm just gonna here by the way here you can see we have all textures so now here you have to just select the all texture which is you want so i'm just gonna select my all texture something like that and after that i will just click the principal texture setup and here you can see when i just click the principal uh, texture setup it will automatically create a whole setup for you you don't need to do anything here you can see it, it will create automatically mapping node it will create automatically texture section and it will also automatically add the displacement node for you so you don't need to do anything you have to just call your textures from your directory and you will get automatically that kind of beautiful node setup now what you have to do you have to just add the subdivision surface modifier into your model so it will look more smoother and more uh cool by the way here you can see yeah now here you can see we have a perfect texture here and which is look nice so how cool it is guys here you can see you have just select only your maps and it will automatically generate the whole node setup for you so i hope guys you enjoy this trick and you learn something new today if you have these kind of maps like roughness map uh, diffuse maps and you don't know how to connect and which node i should connect with which node so you can just use this trick and, and that will definitely help you a lot so that's it for this tutorial guys and if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also and don't forget to download the project file from the description that will be free for my all subscribers so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button and the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries or any session please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys